United Syndications are proud to announce the syndication of an outstanding cult by without doubt one of Australia's most exciting stallions in Sebring. I'm here with Mick Price at the Caulfield Stables, of course, with one of the champions for United Syndications, Royal Snitzel. She's behind us, but Mick, we're here to talk about a beautiful Sebring Colt who might be the next star of the team. He's by Sebring, of course, out of the Mare Tropical Beat, picked up at the Classic Sales. Tell us a little bit about the farm and where this horse has come from. Look, I think this Colt was one of the better horses at Sydney Classic, and uh, it, we bought him off a guy called Stuart Ramsey at Tarunga Farms. Not a big breeder, but uh, Tarunga Farms right opposite Arrowfield there in the middle of Scone. It's a fantastic farm. I remember a few years ago we paid 40 grand for a horse called Schilling that won the uh, Sandown Guineas. Uh, they, bred, they bred probably the same paddock as this horse come out of was a horse called Abel Friend, uh, who's probably one of the best mile horses in Hong Kong, if not the world. Uh, look, he bet Headway won a Group 1, Sky Cuddle won a Group 1. It's a really good farm, really good paddocks, and uh, love buying off them. Sometimes we can't afford them, uh, but it's an exclusive, really good, well-run farm, and uh, yeah, he's a, really, he's a really nice colt. This would be a beautiful uh, mating as well to Sebring, who's done such a great job with Criterion and Dissident. Dissident, of course, a horse that you've seen at close quarters with uh, with Peter Moody. What do you like about the Sebring progeny? Look, uh, good, temp good tempered horses. They're tough. Uh, gets colts and fillies. Uh, obviously, you know, I watched Dissident get trained here, and uh, Criterion's just outstanding, world class animal. Uh, I think if you try and buy Sebring in Sydney Easter, that uh, they'll be pretty damn expensive, you know. He's a stallion, he's, I think he's standing for 60 grand now. He's just getting better and better and better. He's a, he's a really good stallion. Now, the mare's uh, been at Zizou. Uh, I know the first foal out of this mare was a bit small. Uh, the second foal's a flying machine. I think the third foal died. The fourth foal's by O'Reilly. And uh, I know that he won a trial in Adelaide and just got sold to Hong Kong. So it's a bit of a sleeper, this mare. Um, I reckon, I reckon that the mare will throw good horses if they're, if they're like the one we bought. Um, you know, the, the, the um, record of the mare doesn't um, tell us uh, how good the one we bought is. And of course, as you mentioned, the value there through Sebring and what they possibly will bring at Easter. Then you've got that sleeping pedigree, as you say, that O'Reilly, who's got big wraps on him now that he's got to Hong Kong. It's a family that you know fairly well, though, going back a little bit. Aloha's in the pedigree, and she did a great job for you. Look, we, we do know the page pretty well. Uh, the second damn Midnight Rock was a filly we had here uh, for Stuart Ramsey. Now, it was the same year as Rodine, and I remember saying to Stuart, this thing's better than Rodine. It's faster, but uh, had throat issues, and I couldn't quite get it right, so he's just bred from it. It's bred a stakes winner. Uh, we had Aloha here for Jerry Harvey, who's out of the third dam. Beautiful, big, strong, lovely mare. Uh, you know, she got better as she gets older. I think this whole family gets better as she gets older. The Sebring Colt we bought, uh, look, he'll be entered for the two-year-old races, but for sure he's going to be a lovely horse as he matures, you know. I can't wait, you know, to see him beautiful big three-year-old, tough-boned horse, uh, four-year-old. Uh, he's a really nice horse. I can sense the excitement this great man has. You've got one of the best trainers in Australia looking after this Colt. He knows the family. You've got value for money. You've got Sebring. You know what to do. Pick up the phone. Give Peter a call and get involved. For further information on how you can become involved in this outstanding cult, contact United Syndications, AFSL 227184.